We've been given a bigger glimpse into how much The Witcher 3 sold on PC and on console. And I'm here to tell you, as an Xbox enthusiast, the Xbox numbers are troubling to me. Let's get into it. What's up, peoples? It's your boy, MM2K, back again with another one, with another one. Hey, yo, before we get too deep into this one, I need you to do me a huge favor, you know what I'm saying? Can you hit that like button? Can you hit that subscribe button? Rock those bells for notifications, please, so you know when your boy's dropping these doses. I appreciate all of y'all straight up, and I am not too proud to ask. Let's get into it. Okay, so what's your three numbers or percentages sold via PC versus console? Uh, were recently released. Also, what was released was how many sold percentage-wise specifically on PC, how much on PlayStation 4, and how much on Xbox One. So I'm gonna read you the article that details this, and this comes from uh, PCGamesN.com. All right, and it reads as follows. It says, CD Projekt Red has a strong reputation across the gaming community, but the studio has especially endeared itself to PC players. The most popular platform, The Witcher 3, has been PC, but perhaps not quite by the margin you'd expect it. Now the question is, how sales will shake out when Cyberpunk 2077 release date hits? It continues, it breaks it down, it says, 44.5% of The Witcher 3 sales came through PC, trailed by PlayStation 4 at 39.5, and Xbox One at 15.5 all accounting for some rounding funkiness of course the info comes from cd project red's uh financial report okay so there's a lot to, di to digest there and the article is geared more towards talking about how pc became more prevalent over the years as far as being the number one platform but here's what your boy mm2k want to focus on i'm gonna go over those numbers again 44.5 percent on pc 39.5% on PlayStation and only 15.5% on Xbox One? Now, if you do some more research, you'll find that the total Witcher 3 numbers are hovering around 30 million to 33 million as far as sales are concerned. And if you do the math of the Xbox One copy sold, 15% of that 30 to 33 million is hovering around 4.5 million. Now, before y'all sit there and y'all jump out the window and y'all go, MM2K, that's 4 million. What if 4 million become horrible? Let me explain something to you, okay? We are in the eighth generation. This is not the PlayStation 2 and the Xbox One where games cost $55 to make anymore. These games are costing hundreds of millions of dollars to develop for and market these days. So big budget AAA titles like The Witcher 4.5 million ain't gonna cut it. Look, Square Enix told y'all last gen that foreshadow the Tomb Raider or the Tomb Raider reboot series, I'm sorry, that they had to hit at least 7 million in order to recoup all their expenses to just be in the black. So 4 million for a game like Witcher that had a lot of development time, that is thoroughly, thoroughly developed for, you know what I'm saying, and marketing. Man, 4.5 million ain't nothing. Now, before y'all jump out the window again and say, well, 4.5 million, that's just one platform a dead 30 a grand total. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. You got to pay attention to this, people. Witcher 3 is of the game genre that we say defines the Xbox brand. I mean, first there's the whole looter shooter thing, but then there's this Western developed play, uh, uh, um, um, RPG style, kind of like the Skyrim and stuff like that, that Witcher 3 falls right into that brand. And it only sold 15.5% on our unit, and that's supposed to be one of the staples of the Xbox brand? It's not one of the staples of the PlayStation brand. Then I know what y'all thinking as well. MM2K, there's 100 million PlayStations out there opposed to the 40 million Xbox. That's why it's so big. Man, I'm not trying to hear that garbage. Witcher 3 came out in 2015. In 2015, the gap between PlayStation and Xbox was only around 8 million, okay? So again, do the math. This is a game, a triple-A game that we say, oh, this is the game of the generation, not God of War. It fits more into the genres that we say that we like. 
all right when it released the console number difference was only by 8 million the percentage attach rate for this game on the xbox brand should be a lot higher than this and the reason why i'm really worked up about this is because this is why we can't get exclusive content like straight up what the hell are we doing out here i mean think about it y'all we want to boast and brag about how PlayStation is now using the Azure service for streaming and that gamers should have nothing to worry about because streaming is not going to mess with the fidelity of games. It's just giving us another option, right? Companies like CD Projekt Red go out of their way, way after the fact, right? And they go ahead and they enhance, Xbox enhance, The Witcher 3. And as we know, the Xbox One X enhancements are the best enhancements out there on console, right? For them to turn around and still only have 4.5 million sold on the Xbox brand out of 30 million and there's only three platforms that to, to compete with. Under those numbers, what makes you think that developers that are going to put their games out there on streaming services like PlayStation Now and particularly the xCloud are going to really fight for fidelity on consoles if the Xbox console is the least selling platform out there because again Xbox doesn't care where you buy their games and Phil Spencer told you himself that the secret to their sauce is selling you more software and selling you less hardware that came from Phil Spencer himself so if you create a dynamic where within your ecosystem your console isn't doesn't have a lot of saturation okay and that's okay with you because again you're bringing your software everywhere which okay i get it what makes you think again that developers are going to go out of their time you know what i'm saying for free to make these games all poppy and all this other stuff when they don't have to because most of the software being sold for that ecosystem that you're a part of is being sold for tablets and phones and all that other stuff, okay? So think about it, people. It's important. When developers take AAA games, fantastic AAA games like this, damn well the best AAA game that we've seen in a while, and they X enhance it and they put it on our console of choice, that y'all go out there and y'all support the damn thing, man. What is y'all doing out here? Y'all only, again, as I always like to say, y'all cutting off y'all nose to spite y'all face, man. So even with all this hoopla about, you know, PlayStation bending the knee, and I'm out here having fun on social media about it too. I don't want to hear no more about that until I start seeing y'all buy some damn games. Facts. And that's it from your boy MM2K. It's getting ridiculous out here. Sitting there buying Sea of Thieves and leaving it on while y'all go to work. Nice nice getting four to five million. <laughs> State of Decay getting four to five million. And Witcher 3 been out for 30 damn years. And that barely peaked for Man, come on, man. We can do better than this. Y'all got me out here like my boy Porter Rock. 55K? <laughs> but I feel his pain now. But with that said, you know what I'm saying? Let me know what you think about what I had to say in the comment section below. As I always tell y'all, y'all can come with me or come at me. It don't matter to your boy. But if you did like what you heard, you know what I'm saying? You can catch me on the corner every boulevard, you know what I'm saying? Check the links below to follow me. Hey, yo, I do a show with your peoples. Nethos, Snow Bunny, Dirt Griggity. It's called Scram Punks, man. One of the best podcasts out there. Check us out on Dirt Griggity's channel. If you need more information, just look up hashtag Scram Punks, man. You'll find all the information that you need. And last but not least, follow my brother and the broadband bullies. We out here doing the damn thing. Check that Discord link. Check that Patreon link. Show us some support and some love. And yo, and check out that merchandise. Check out the link to that gear, man. It's fly. And as always, as always, get out here and buy some goddamn games. And have a wonderful game day. Ha, 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 ha.